This local sports report is presented by the Branton District Football Club. Learn more about their tackle and flag programs by visiting bisonsfootball.ca. U12 OFFL football from Bison's Alumni Field in Brantford. The Brantford Bison's and the Hamilton Junior Tie Cats kicking off on Saturday. Let's jump right to the kickoff and watch for the return. Jace Curry picks the ball up into zone 20 and starts downfield. It's a couple broken tackles and Jace takes off into open space. It's a wide open green for Jace and he take it 90 yards for a kickoff return touchdown. What a start for Brantford and it's 8-0 Bison's right off the rip. A good start for the Bisons, but the Ticats would answer right back. Tom DeLuca lobs a pass over the pack. Xavier Campbell in on the reception. He turns tail and takes it to the house for a touchdown. So we're all tied up at 8-8. This one off to a hot start and the touchdowns would keep coming. This is Evan McLaughlin on the carry for Brantford. He escapes out the near wing and steps around a couple tackles. It's the end zone for Evan and he's got a touchdown. So it's 14-8 Brantford. The Bison's rolling on offense and land the quarter. They look to strike again. It's a lateral pass to Jace Curry, and Jace takes off down the near sideline. And he's good for a Bison's first down. Same Bison's possession here. They are on the one-yard line. It's a QB keeper getting it done. Carmine D'Antonio steps over the line, and it's 22 for the Bison's. The Bison's running up the score, and they keep the touchdowns coming. Here's Evan McLaughlin on another run for Brantford. He finds space on the far wing and takes the rock all the way home for another touchdown. And the Bisons are at 30. In the third quarter now, and the Bisons would add another touchdown. It's Jace Curry finishing this one off, and the Bisons are up by 30. The Ticats trailing, and they look to cut into the Bisons' lead. It's a good pass from Tom DeLuca. He completes to Shane Abaji, and Shane turns tail. It's full speed ahead from the big man. Alex Aspton, with a great tackle, stops him short of a TD. The Ticats would need a finisher, and it's Oliver Hoge stepping up to get it done. He takes it into the end zone, and the Ticats are at 16. Hamilton mounting a comeback, and later in the quarter, they strike again. Xavier Campbell escapes out the near wing and flies downfield for another touchdown. And the Ticats are back within 14, heading to the half. In the third quarter, the Ticats kicking off, and how about another kickoff return? It's Jace Curry back on the return for the Bisons. He's motoring downfield. Jace only has one man to beat, and he's in there for his third TD of the game. And it's 46-24 Bisons. In the fourth quarter, now the Ticats in the red zone. It's Xavier Campbell picking up another TD. He brings it to the end zone, and it's 46-32. But after a good run from Jace Curry, it's Carmine D'Antonio finishing off an answer. That brings Brantford's score to 54, and the Bisons would go on to win it. So it's the Brantford Bisons running up the scoreboard and taking a back-and-forth scoring contest over the Hamilton Ticats. This one ending with a final score of 54-40 on Saturday.